Saturday morning, uh, the girls wake me up extremely early this morning, especially that girl over there. Leslie's been gone out of the house for since Wednesday. She's been in Pittsburgh this week. <laughs> So the girls have been staying in the house a lot. I've been having to go to the office and all that. So I feel like they woke up really early today. Like you don't have to go to work, take us out. Uh, so yeah, just get them in dirty before the inevitable shower. But looks like they're enjoying their time. Look at this. Kyle, you're having fun? <laughs> I know I haven't been made this in a while. Oh, she almost she got it. Uh, I think it's one of the like almost a year since uh, my last video. I think. Yeah, dude, it was just like. Oh, this. There she goes. Look at her. It was like a lot of things. I was like totally focused on the band. Like every time that I have available, it was just to work in the band. But that is done. That's a video for the next time. So yeah, quick update in this whole year. Well, first of all, this lady got here. She has gotten super big, right, Sonny? Almost a year and a half. Uh, and she's been doing great. Tyra is finally growing into herself. She just like, as any husky do, whatever she wants. She doesn't care about anybody. If I can describe living with Kyra while she's growing, it's been just such a pleasure, man. She's just such a sweet dog. She doesn't do anything. She's <laughs> just great. How you doing? <laughs> we totally move our offices, so I'm no longer working in Ewar City. I'm working now closer to the airport. So that means that I cannot take my one wheel anymore. So I have to like stay in traffic. This is my new commute to work. It's great. And like the funny part is like, I used to work there, work in this building here. Then I moved to Johnson & Johnson. I worked there for three years. Then we moved to Wise. I was working in Ewer. Then Wise decided to move there. Wise and like full circle, come back to the same place. Now that I think about it, it doesn't feel that good. <laughs>
dude, the girls has been full of sleep since we got back from the beach. It's crazy. Usually I go like wild all day, like Sunny can go for hours all day, and now she's just like full of sleep. <laughs> Alright, so the baby's sleeping, but the plan is putting a wall here with like some rock climbing so the baby can go up. No crash pad. Parents at work, I'm just watching. Now we just have to like cut this piece of wood. It's got it to fit that size. We're only gonna need like 30 more inches and then we can drill it to the wall. Andrushka, how you doing? <laughs> you eating your food? Huh? What do you got there? Potatoes and turkey. What do you got? Can I get some? Can I get some? What are you doing? First section of the wall is done. Later, uh, both of this is done. This is where it's dark, and then this one goes on top of this one. I think this one is four feet, and this one is an extra two feet or two and a half feet. So in total, he has six feet of climbing. <laughs> Dude, <laughs> if I come back and I see that baby all the way up there, I'll be a, such a proud uncle. No, I'm gonna be done. Dude, this wall is taller than I thought it was gonna be. Now that baby is planning to go all the way up here. And then that way he can jump to this thing. No, for real, he's gonna need like some crash pad there or something like to actually land his fall. But I think it's pretty good. Uh, we're still waiting on Andre to come and test it. He just went out with mom. Uh, we're waiting for them to arrive and see how it goes. But it feels solid. Like, yeah, you pull on it. Like, I bet it could hold me, but I'm not gonna test it. <laughs> All right, so the wall is installed. Uh, Andre is out with mommy, so he couldn't tie it, but. This guy's gonna send me a video of it once Andre tested it. It's a good day. Alright, that's it for today. Take care. Peace.